as you can see that nine is already there, so I stop. And these are my factors for forty-five. The next number is sixty. One sixty is a two goes in sixty. Yes, two thirty is a three goes in sixty. Yes, three twenty is a four goes in sixty. Four one the four four twenty is the uh, four five is a twenty. So four ones are four. Remainder two four five is a twenty. So four fifteen is a five. Yes. Five twelve are sixty. Six. If the number it is divisible by two and three, then it will be divisible by six. So six ten is a seven. No, sixty does not come in seven times ten. Eight. Sixty does not come in eight times ten either. Nine. No, not sixty also doesn't come in nine times ten. Ten, ten is already there, so I stop. Let's go to the next one. One hundred and five is a hundred and five. Two, no, because it's an odd number. Three, one plus five, six. Yes, test of divisibility. So hundred and five is divisible by three. Three threes are nine. Three fives are fifteen. Three threes are nine. From ten you get one. You put the one here. Three fives are fifteen. So thirty fives are three thirty fives are hundred and five. Let's go to the next number. Four. Last two digits divisible by four? No. Five. The last digit ending with five? Yes. That is why I have taught you test of divisibility. If you do not know test of divisibility, you will not be able to find the factors of a particular number. So five goes. Five twos are ten. Five ones are five. So five twenty one six. No, it had to be divisible by two only. Then it would have been divisible by six. It's only divisible by three. Seven. Seven ones are seven. Remainder three. Seven fives are thirty five. So seven does go. Seven ones are seven. From ten take away seven, you get three. Seven fives are thirty five. So seven fifteen. Eight last three digits no. Nine nine ones are nine. Fifteen no. Ten it has to end with zero no. Eleven no. Twelve hundred five is not coming twelve times ten. Neither does it come in thirteen and neither does it come in fourteen. So the next number is fifteen and fifteen is already ten. Now I circle my common factors one. One, one, three, 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 five, five, five. Is there any more? Is there any more? Yes. Fifteen, fifteen, fifteen. So the common factors out here are common. Factors arrow one three five and so this is your work A and B has to be done in the notebook. You can do A and B first or first copy C B E F and then do A and B. That's not a problem. So that will be done in the blueprint. A and B will be done in the blueprint, and this you have to copy from the.